you slide this time, but you need to go brush your teeth before you miss school, little girl. I don't want to go to school today. You don't want to go to school today? Teacher, I thought you loved school. What's wrong? Is it one of your teachers? No, I like my teacher. Well, is it your classmates? Well, there is this boy. He's always picking on me, pulling my hair, and pushing me down. Those boys. Baby, that's just boys being boys. It's just the way they are. Does he do that to any of the other little girls? Sometimes, but mainly to me. I don't like it. <laughs> Baby, it sounds to me like he likes you, though. You see, when boys like little girls, they don't quite know how to show it, so they might hit you in the arm or pull your hair or... Or push me down. Or push you down. Yeah, baby, that's just boys being boys. Hey, hey, Jackie! Uh, get my coffee ready. I'm gonna be late for work. Was Dad like that when he was a little boy? I didn't know your dad when he was a little boy. Finish up. <laughs> Good morning, ladies. How's my girls this morning? Fine. Uh, you ready for school, baby girl? I wanna go. Uh, what you say? I can't hear you. Speak up, baby. She, she's just having some... What's I talking to you? Shut up and get me a cup of coffee. So now, what's the problem, Dee? Talk to me. Uh, I said I don't want to go to school. Don't want to go to school? You got to go to school. You don't want to grow up stupid like your mama, do you? <laughs> now, you tell your daddy why you don't want to go to school. There's this boy. It, it's just some boy in school. He's been teasing her, and I, I, I told her that he may like her and he just don't know how to show it. That's, that's all. Well now, what's he doing to you, baby? He punches me, he pulls my hair, and shows me down all the time. <laughs> I hate to say it, but your mama's probably right. My little girl has an admirer. Now when he starts trying to kiss you, that's when you worry. And that's when you call me and I'll tease on him a little bit. Now you go on and finish your milk and get to school. Baby, go ahead and brush your teeth, okay? Uh, wh what the hell are you doing? She needs I to... told her to finish her milk. I know, but she needs to go brush her teeth and she's gonna miss school. Well, she's got time. I mean, I, I told her to drink her milk and she's gonna drink it. Okay. I, I, I worked too hard to pay for that milk and everything else around yeah, here. And, 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 she and, and she, it ain't teeth. gonna get wasted. Don't now, yell. you hear me, woman? Teacher, it's okay. Don't... D D. D. Please, I, I yeah, need you, just let her go Deidre, brush her teeth. get up here and drink Calvin, your please, milk. Please, just let her D go brush D her teeth. Dee, get up here and drink your milk. Calvin, well, I tell down. you what, somebody gonna drink this damn milk. Calvin, drink I this damn milk. Calvin, stop! Stop! Next stop. time you listen to me, I'm the man of this house and I will be obeyed. You hear me, woman? It's okay, baby. Daddy loves us. It's okay. They love us. <laughs> You see? You see what you've done now? This is all your fault. Why can't you listen to me? Where's my baby? Where's D? Why can you listen to me?
D, where in the hell are you going? Why do you care? What you, what you say? Don't you give me that lip? Don't you know I can still come over there and knock that smart mouth right off your face? You hear me, girl? I'm sorry, baby, I'm sorry. Come on over here, baby, I just wanna talk to you, that's all. Come on over here, baby. I ain't gonna hurt you, I love you, you know that. That's what makes me so damn crazy sometimes. Now, where is it you are going? Over to my friend Yvette's house. Oh, it's gonna be there? No. You better not be lying to me, you hear me? I'm not lying, I swear. I don't want no thought of mine messing around, you hear? Dad! You, you hear what I'm trying go. to tell you? Let go of me! Just make sure you're not going to be like your mama, girl. You being a slut. I would not have no thought of mine hoeing around. You hear me? Who you going after her, bitch? You both hoes, who needs you? A pair of hoes. You just waiting on me to die, I know you. I know, yeah. But what you gonna do then, bitch? You ain't gonna be nothing without me. Both y'all, both y'all. When I die, you gonna die too. You hear me? You hear me? I hate him. He frustrates me. D, that's your father. Not by choice. You're strong. I, everything is going to be OK. I don't know how strong I am, but You can't let it get to you. Just don't worry about it. Well, I won't have to worry about it too much longer. Yvette, what's going on, girl? Jerome, what are you doing here? Working, working, working. Hey, check this out. I got a gig tonight. To... Hey, who's your friend, Yvette? This is Deidre. D. How you doing, Deidre? D? I've been better, Jerome. I got a gig tonight down at the beach. You guys should come through. That sounds like fun. D, I would love to see you there. We'll be there. Yeah? Yeah. Seven o'clock. All right. All right. Bye, Jerome. Bye, ladies. Bye, D. He was hitting on you. What do you mean, hitting on me? As in you're hot? <sighs> no. We're going. To the beach? Yeah. Did you forget what happened? My father would kill me, Vet. I didn't forget, but we need to have fun. No, no. You need to have fun. We are going. Well, I guess I do need to have some fun. Please. Let's do it. So, did you enjoy the show? It was all right. Just all right. Yeah, just all right. <laughs> but that drummer was pretty cute. Oh, though. whatever. <laughs> well, I appreciate you coming out. No, to be honest, I probably wouldn't have had been afraid there. Come on, you know you like my jokes. I didn't like the last 20 you told me. So, uh, do you like me? I just met you. Well, I like you. You just met me. So I can't like because I just met you? I think once you got to know me, you probably wouldn't like me so much anymore. I highly doubt it. So, um, I know I'd like to see you again. Me? Really? Yeah, I don't know, something, something, something small. Coffee, maybe dinner in a movie? I don't know. I don't know. Come on. starting to get over his death and move on. Listen, you know how much I love you. I never want you to worry about anything ever again. Because I'm going to protect you. I'm going to take care of you. And I will keep you safe. Are you really going to keep me safe? Of course, always. And you're not going to let anyone hurt me? Baby, 
anybody tries to hurt you, I'll handle it. As long as you with me, you don't have to worry about anything. You hear me? Hey, where my beautiful mama to be? How are my babies doing? Don't be acting like that. Jerome, you have to go to work in the morning. I know I gotta go to work. I'ma go, don't worry. I do worry. One of them has to. What you say? Just nothing's wrong. Let's just, let's just go to bed. You better sit down when I'm talking to you. Jerome! Well, tell me what to do. You got the boss of me. Jerome! What you made me do? It's all your fault! You hear me? You hear me? You hear me? You hear me? Does he still have his job, baby? Yes, Mama. He still has his job. For now. Still has his temper, too, in case you haven't noticed. Lord have mercy. Baby, how long are you gonna put up with this? When are you gonna take little Maya and get away from him for good? How long did you put up with it, Mama? Teacher, don't hmm? you start. Until he died? Until he died. That's how long you put okay. up with it, Mama. Okay, Deidre, that's enough. D. Hey, you remember Mr. Davis at the church, don't you? Mm-hmm. Well, for the past couple of Sundays, he's been sitting next to me. He's been trying to invite me for coffee or dinner or something. Or something. Sounds like Mr. Davis is hitting on you. <laughs> Better watch out. Who's been hitting on you, Grandma? Oh, baby, nobody's hitting on your grandma. All that means is just, well, it just means that Mr. Davis really likes Grandma. That's right. Is that why Daddy hit you, Mommy? 